Yo, it's good. I need you to turn the camera. Dude, that's Zach, that's Zach. Nobody can be filming it. I'm not filming, he has the camera. Yo, what is going on everybody? How are you guys doing today? So guys, I got a little bit of a different video planned for today. So basically, I've been having, I don't even know how to describe it, but there's this fan that is originally from New York. I really don't know how, like, other way to put it, besides the fact that he's, like, literally my number one fan and, like, obsessed with me. Like, he literally, like, has a crush on me too. Like, this whole thing is such a long story, like, so much to, like, explain. I don't even know where to start, basically, but this kid's been basically messaging me, like, nonstop, like, crazy. Like, this is all within the past 20 24 hours. I'm not even joking. I'm still scrolling. This is all within the past 24 hours. It's crazy. But there's a bunch of other like backstories to this. But like, I just want to say like this kid's honestly like been, he's my biggest fan and I want to be there for him. I don't know. It's really hard to explain, but I want to really make this kid's day because he's been going through such a hard time recently. I'm not going to like show this kid's Instagram or anything because I don't want him getting any hate. He's a really good kid. He's just like, I don't know, just at a very weird point in his life right now. And I want to help him out. I want to do something nice for him. I want to take him on a shopping spree today. I want to make his day. But yeah, guys, we're going to be going to the mall right now to go meet up with this fan tell you guys a little bit about his story and then take him on a shopping spree and make his day guys let's go i'll see you at the mall Woo! all right guys so one thing i really want to say is i'm not at all trying to like put this kid on blast like make fun of him make him feel uncomfortable anything like this kid asked me like to make a video with him and like i don't know it would definitely make his day and he's been going through some hard times and i want to help him out but yeah it's like awkward for us because it does make us feel super unsafe because we don't know these people we don't know what their intentions are like but uh sam decided to come wow. <laughs> Excited, right? What are you doing? Dude, I I'm nervous, bro. I'm I have to pee, bro. Bro. I'm nervous, bro. This is a big day. This homie's about to ball out, bro. I'm about to take him shopping. I see your penis is showing. Really? No. <laughs> Yo, it's good. It's good, bro. So I can't believe I'm actually here. Hey, I'll give you a hug, bro. I'll give you oh, a hug. So. Let's go. Hey, I want to say thank you for watching the video. Thank you oh, for yeah. supporting me. No problem. But yeah, you want to say what's up to the vlog? Oh, yeah. What's up, everybody? I'm, I'm, I'm really nervous, clearly. Hey, but you want to tell him like, your story or something? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, well, first, we well, don't want to like you know like make you uncomfortable. Oh, yeah. No. Whatever. You know, whatever you're comfortable with, you know? Yeah. Well, I... Like, here, you want to sit down? Oh, sure. I'm a squat next to me, yeah. bud. Anyway, so you guys are probably all wondering who the heck I am. Um, I've been watching Jack Doherty here for um, a couple of years now. The reason I came all the way here, um, I'm from upstate New York. It's not very, not very many things around there. It's, um, it's kind of, it's, it's, yeah, it's kind of in the middle of nowhere. So it gets very lonely, very isolating. Here, there's a lot of public transportation, buses, and like that, you know. How old are you? I just turned 23, so I know that might seem a little bit old. I hope uh, it's old. Okay. Yeah, it's cool. Yeah, but um, how long have you been watching my videos for? Since um, oh gosh, I think it was September 2019. Oh dang. Hey. Yeah, well what happened was is um okay back then I was what like I was only like twenty I think. I um Yeah, I think I think you told me that you came to my house one time before. Oh shit. What what was that? Like we should explain that really quick. Oh yeah, back in Cause I well, how long ago was that? Like two years ago I think you came to my back, house. Back in February twenty twenty, yeah, that was very awkward. I How'd yeah. you get there? Cause don't uh, you live like eight hours away? Or I regret doing that. No, probably like oh, five right. or six hours away. I know you guys probably think I'm some some weirdo or something nah, going on. No, you're but, um, a really good fan. I think you're oh. very nice. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Well, I, very kind. Yeah. So yeah, back in February 2020, I was, um, well, that was uh, kind of a hard time for me. My mom was uh, with a, with an abusive stepdad and he had kicked me out of the house. Um, so I, I had stayed in a hotel. So my mom was working at a hotel. She let me stay there for a few months. And that's actually when I discovered Jack's videos. And I, um, at Super Bowl Sunday of 2020, I went back. And then I, I really enjoyed Jack's videos. I, he seemed like, I don't know, I like, felt like I grew a personal connection. Um, and I really wanted to get to know him, so I took a great home bus. It's probably like five. It's probably like a five-hour trip. And um, the elementary school by your house it made it kind of obvious. Damn, we got you uh, tracked me down, and then he yes, tracked down Steven yes, Share. Like Bud went on the videos. Like look, he literally said he went look at the bushes and found the Bud Steven. That was oh my crazy. Gosh. Look. It, it wasn't, it wasn't. Buzz a detective, yo. We need this guy to be hired. No, I, You're I, crazy, my boy. Yeah, I, I In a good way. Do you have all of your things with you? I do. No, I've been here for about three weeks, so I didn't have a place to sleep. I, I was walking all over. I, I couldn't sleep on the sidewalk, you know, because someone could steal all my, all my stuff. And, Something even if it was just to point me in the right direction, you know. Yeah, I know. I'm, that's why I'm here. That's why I came, yeah. you know, to meet up with you, bro. Like, yeah. I want to help you, you know. Yes. Yeah, so, so that was really just out of pure desperation, going to yeah. Steve's house. If you deal with any like anxiety, or depression, we're also here to talk to you, like be there for you. Yeah, well, that's awesome. And, um, so I hope this doesn't change your guys' opinion of me. No. Uh, but when I was 
when I was younger, I was diagnosed with autism spectrum disorder. You, you know, it takes a lot of courage to tell you something like that. Yeah, I know. You're um, really yeah, no, I know. I have a lot of respect for you. So, so back to when I went to your house. So I knocked on the door and um, Mark, uh, Jack's father, had answered. He's, he's actually really nice. He, um, it was really a nice conversation we had. We talked about my employment at Walmart. He said he wasn't really a Walmart person. Um, yeah. <laughs> we said you yeah. worked at Walmart. I did. I worked there for a year. Yeah, and yeah. that's what I remember. He would I remember never saying, Jack out. No. "Nah, he would never." never. No. He would, never he, would, he would take me to the back. You know what, yeah. the back. what do you mean by that? I think your dad thinks I'm crazy or something. It doesn't matter what my dad thinks. Daddy's rich. That's all that matters. Yeah, that's right. It seems like you've been going through like a hard time right now. Oh yeah. Well, well, my mom's current boyfriend. He's actually my favorite out of her boyfriends. Well, we had an argument before we left. That's part of the reason why I wanted to leave. Um, because he wasn't handling it too well, our argument, and um, it was very awkward. Another reason I came out here is because my mom didn't believe I could leave New York State. I could move out of New York State. And I really wanted to prove to her that I could. Wait, how'd you get here? Oh, Greyhound bus. You, you took a bus to California from New York? I did. How long was the bus? It was for like four days. Holy <laughs> Yeah. So you've been homeless in California for three weeks? Well, I've been staying in Airbnbs and hotels. Um, ah. I, I couldn't stay in the first Airbnb. <laughs> um, it was, I don't think the kitchen was cleaned once. There was food all over the stove the entire time I was there. Damn. Um, the vacuum was broken. It was too small. There was a small house. They had like six people in each bedroom. There was like three or four bedrooms. There was only one bathroom. And I just, I just couldn't yeah. stand it there anymore. It was too nasty. I couldn't. I couldn't cook in the kitchen, so I spent a whole month. I spent for a whole month to stay at the Airbnb. Then I changed my mind because I wasn't sure what I was going to do. So I tried to get a refund, but then I, my refund took a few days. So then, um, really, most of my money was at the Airbnb. So that's why, I, like the last couple of days, I didn't really have a place to go. And then I finally got the refund, and my mom sent me two hundred dollars. So then I had fourteen hundred dollars, which is enough to get me through for a couple of days. Uh, which was really nice. It, it changed. It, it really changed my mood. I really had to swallow my pride to be homeless, you know, because it was very embarrassing. My my old manager, shout out to my old manager, um, he had hired me back, which is really nice. So are you going back to New York? Yeah, tomorrow at 6:30 a.m. Oh, that's good. That's, that's, that's awesome. when that's when the plane leaves. Um, well, so. is there anything you want me to do to like help you out at all? Like, I'll, you want to go shopping? I'll buy you some clothes. Oh, like, no, I, I I wouldn't expect you to do that. Nah, bro, let's do it. Let's run it up. Oh, yeah, do you no, want some food? I just, had, like, I just had some. I want to ball out with you, my boy. Just, like, I, I, but yeah, like I want to take you like shopping. Like, oh. let's go to H and M. Let's go buy some clothes. Like, oh, we want to... Natalie to be all over you by the end of today. Oh, oh, <laughs> and I, Sam. I'm like, too ugly. No, you're not. Like, no. I think you're more attractive than Zach over here. Oh. All right, guys, we are at H and M. As you can see, what size are you? What size are you? What size? Yeah. You mean like. Like, like clothing size. Oh, I, I wear a large t-shirt. All right, cool. So let's go copy some bunch of large clothes, my boy. Let's no, strip I, you I out. Yo, I have that same we'll, hoodie. We'll cop Matt. Yeah, this is Zach. Zach has this exact hoodie. We'll cop. So we'll all three of us have matching sweatshirts. Uh -huh. And nobody uh, else will. Just be I think this three. one's pretty fire. I, I think the Simpsons. Yeah, I'll get you both. But like this one, because Zachary has this one, uh -huh. and I want this one too. So it's like I'll get this one for me, you know. So now we'll all be matching. Unless is uh, that you think I'll fit? Large? Oh yeah, yeah. I think I have this one too. But so. you don't have to give me two of them. Bro, I'm gonna get you a hella. Here you go, my boy. Let's go. Or do you want like pants? Cause you're going back to New York, so you might. Oh, you're, yeah. It's gonna be cold, you know. Yeah. So let's go pack some pants. <laughs> What's your favorite color? I have a lot of favorite colors. What's like your number one though? Do you like this one? I feel that's something I'd wear, you know? I, I, I wear just about anything you want. You like this though? Yeah. Is that hard? Yeah. I'm I not, like that. I, I'm so. not even very fussy about my clothes. You know, anymore. I'm going to cop myself one of these too because yeah. these go hard. Actually, no. I buy way too many clothes. Yeah, I'll buy it. Fudge it. Oh, what was that? Dude, I really kicked sorry. out. IRL kicked out video with the bud? Oh Listen, this is my number one fan. <laughs> Please, let me show Yeah, you. we're taking him on a shopping spree. Come on, yeah, we yeah. can't take him on a yeah, shopping spree? Yeah, no, it has to go through a corporate. Do you know who this guy is? It's my number one fan. Like, <laughs> let me share this moment with him. It's a special moment. Come on. No, unfortunately, it's, we can't let you. It's not a camera. It's not a camera. Yeah. It's a ring doorbell. That's why yeah. We can't have anything like that in It's the ring. No, it's a ring doorbell. We're sponsored by them. It has to go through our H&M corporate. Anything with any type oh, no. of camera. My dad owns H&M, so <laughs> we're automatically chilling. I need you to turn the camera. Oh no, it's not even on. It's a ring doorbell. You never, you never hit. Wait, the yo, tell her again. I said his daddy owns Rodeo. Yeah, yeah, my dad owns Rodeo too. You want some jeans? Yeah, you don't have to buy me all these clothes. Bro, I got you. It's the least I can do. Rip jeans. You're gonna be looking straight at LA. Every when you go back to New York, everyone's gonna be like, Yo, you're just in LA, my boy. Like, I'll just check out for me. It's cool. It's cool. I got this ready. No. What are we scanning so far? Just one jersey. All right. Um. <laughs> all right. Cool. So so now we take it off here, and then we'll hit it with a little. H&M fold, but first we gotta pop the tag off, guys. How do we do that? Oh, right only, here. Only you would do this. Oh, I think I figured it out. You have to push. Uh, oh, I did it. Let's go. 
I did it. Doherty, you should check out oh, yeah, just I all the this, clothes. I got this, I got this. Trust, trust. I'm sorry, I get paid. <laughs> I don't need to get paid. My daddy's rich. <laughs> you know the vibes. Oh. Sir, I'll be with you in a minute if that's cool. I just don't like looking at that. It kind of sketches me out. Does it? Yeah. Okay. I get a little attracted to that. So it's too hot. It's too hot to handle. You know what I mean, my bud. I'm not behind the cash point. Like I told you, my dad owns this place. Like you don't believe yeah. me. That's crazy. I can't have you behind the cash point. Prove it. It's a security for everyone. Oh. You can't be behind the cash point because you're near yeah. where money is. It's a loss prevention issue. Uh, you get Zach. Oh, oh, Zach's right, right here. Oh, right I, here. Got, I, got, I got Zach. Um, I got Zach. Yes, I'm gonna help you. No, our other person. And oh. I can't have you guys filming. Oh, well, why wouldn't you just say that? Yo, let's hope Zach doesn't come. Yeah. We'll fudge if Zach comes. Zach. Oh, yo, I think Zach's. Oh, that's Zach. Oh. Check me out. Check me out before Zach comes. Quick, Zach's coming, please. Yo, Zach's coming faster. <laughs> faster. Dude, that's Zach. That's Zach. Yo. We gotta go. This purchase is done. You guys no, I didn't pay it. <laughs> yeah. You're not paying for it. Zach. But no, I'm buying him clothes. We asked you guys nice. No, We're to. buying him clothes. Okay, sure, be filming in the store. Okay, so. but we need to buy him. You nope. don't understand how special this is. No. Yeah, like, you're so mean, like for that. Okay. Yo, everyone, cancel this guy right now. Yeah, cancel sure. this guy. Cancel Zach from H and M. Guys, you gotta go. But no, okay, let me buy go. this for him. Like, come no. on, you don't. Like, nope. that's not cool. That's Fudge this not... guy, right? Yeah. That is Fudge Zach. Not P of you. He is not pushing P at all. Turn the film off. Turn the ring doorbell off. Film okay. off. Nobody can be filming. I'm not door. filming. He has the camera. Both you guys. Zach. I'm not filming. It's literally it's a ring His doorbell. Zach, so he thinks he has authority because you're Zach too. Boy, just threw two hundred and forty-nine thousand dollars. Look at that. It's crazy. Okay, what do you guys want? Whatever he wants. What do you want? Right, what do you want? Oh. Um, my number one fan right there. Number one fan, all right. Make it with extra love. Extra love. Extra to Poppy Moon Yen Yo in that hoe. You know the vibes. Zach wants a side order of big cock. I want a side order of some big meat. Uh, Daddy? Daddy? All right, Daddy. You know the vibes. Daddy's right. 2089. All right, we got a little bit idea. How well do you know Jack Doherty? Tell me all the, the little weird little things that you know that nobody else would probably know. What? I know that you like Welch's great fruit snacks. Okay, Welch's fruit snacks, yep. I know that you write with your left hand. That's true, I write with my left hand. Like every January, February, like the last three years. I you just get the urge every February to like, dang, Jack Doherty, it's been a year, like I gotta go see him again. Oh, yeah, February 2020, it was yeah. your house, and um, I, I won't say, last year, oh yeah, I, so, similar to this year, except I had more money this time, but I had gone to Long Island. Hey, yeah. well, I just want to say, you're my number one fan, oh. bro, you always will be. If anyone asks who's your number one fan, you're the one that comes to mind, oh, bro, oh, you're a legend. Well, thank you. I'm grateful I got to spend a day oh. with you, I hope I made your day, you know, you I had a good time with you, oh. I hope this made your day, like, you. you know, like, you're a good kid. Hey, yeah. this guy's the homie, I'm a man. Miss you, bud. I'm gonna miss you. All right. Anything you want to say to the people? Well, I I wanted to say that um, I do struggle with the um, anxiety, depression, um, and um, like towards the end of high school, I started to kind of deal with like um, what, what seems like OCD to me sometimes, and, and um, you know um, fight those urges. Yeah. Do this so I could really enjoy this, and, and I did, and I appreciate. One last hug, nice bud. One last hug. Nice meeting you. Just thank you. Nice meeting you, bud. Well, thanks so much. You, you guys really made my really made the whole trip worth it. Hey, I, no problem. I'm and, glad I could. I'm glad I made yeah. the trip. That means the most to me. Yeah, I got to give you something. Oh, he has a gift for me. Uno reverse card. Yeah, nah, bro. Don't, don't give me money. Card. No, I wouldn't give you money, bro. No way. No, bro. That's your money, bro. That's your money, bro. I, I will not take anything from you. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh. Yeah, that was hot. He picked me up. That was so hot. Yes, it was. All right, guys, so that was crazy. That was like the craziest experience ever. I'm glad I got to make his trip because I'm sure if he went home not getting to meet me or anything, he would have been so bummed out. And I'm glad I got to make his trip because he's been here. He's been here for three weeks trying to meet me, and I met him on his last day. And I'm glad I got to make his day, take him shopping, do all that good stuff because I know he's going to have a crazy trip now, and I know that he's super happy. That's going to go ahead and wrap it up for this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to drop a like, comment, share this video with all your friends, turn on notifications after you smash the subscribe button with post notifications on, set them to all i will see you in the next one peace out hey, <laughs> hey. jack doherty is so much better than ivp <laughs> <laughs>